Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's Amisha Maria. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get this super cute twist out. So stay tuned. So I'm starting off on freshly washed, blow dried, and kind of straightened hair. I tried to straighten my hair, but it was a complete fail. It didn't come out the way that I wanted, so I'm just going to turn it into a style. So I'm just detangling it, running my wide tooth comb through just to make sure there's no tangles and make it as smooth as possible. I'm going to make a part down the middle of my head, put one side up, and then make a medium sized part going down. So I'm taking my Melanin Hair Care Twisting Cream. I absolutely love this stuff. And I'm going to apply that to the section. And I'm sure to focus on my ends because they are super dry. I need to trim really badly. <laughs> and then I'm gonna take the Melanin Hair Care Hair Oil, which is another one of my faves, and apply that to the section as well. Then I'm going to take my detangling brush. I believe this is the Felicia Leatherwood brush. And I'm going to brush that product through and make sure my hair is as smooth as possible. And then I'm going to start at the top and just make a simple braid going down. Unfortunately, this is not a how to braid tutorial because honestly, I can't braid that well. This video is only about eight minutes, but it took me an hour to get the braids how I wanted it to. So, yeah. <laughs> Once I got to the ends of my hair I did add a little bit more product because you want it to be as smooth as possible then I'm going to take a small perm rod and wrap my ends around it this just helps my ends to have a curl to them instead of being straight so it can look a bit more uniform when I do take the braids down so I'm just going to repeat that on the rest of the sections by applying the cream to my hair and the ends adding oil to it smoothing it out with my brush and then braiding and again you do want the hair to be as smooth as possible so don't be afraid to run the brush through your hair as needed and or apply more cream And this is what the first side looks like. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side off camera. My hair is nice and smooth, shiny, and done. So I did keep the braids in overnight. I didn't need to sit under the dryer or anything. I simply slept with the style. So I'm going to take my melanin hair oil and apply that to my hands. This is just to help prevent any unnecessary frizz. And I kept this clip in real time just so you can see how gentle I am with undoing the braid. And the nice thing about these braids is that they do tend to separate on their own. So 
by only separating it where it naturally wants to separate that's going to help prevent any further frizz. And you just wanna be extremely gentle just so you can get the best results. So I did go ahead and take out the other side off camera and this is how it looks once it is all taken out. I think it looks really good. I love that it has a nice shine to it. It's soft, it's flowy, and like I said, is not much frizz. And that's because we didn't force any sections apart. We simply just let it section off where it wants to. So I'm taking a wide tooth comb and fluffing out the back of my hair just to try to get rid of that part that was down the middle. And then I'm going to do a bit more fluffing. I didn't want to do too much again because I didn't want to add too much frizz, but you can go ahead and just fluff it out a bit to make it bigger if you want to. I also did my edges off camera and yeah, this is the final look. Again, I absolutely love it. I think it came out great. And that is the end of this video. If you did enjoy it, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you have not already and I will see you in my next video. Bye.